Hey there guys, welcome to my Synthesia AI tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how to use this tool known as Synthesia AI. This is going to be a step-by-step -step guide tutorial on how to use it. And this tool is basically known for setting up AI avatars that a lot of people are using to create videos. So step number one, what you need to do is to go to Synthesia.io and sign up for an account. I'm not going to walk you through that because it feels really easy. And if you need help getting to the website or the dashboard, consider using my affiliate link in the description to get there. What you can also do next is figure out what you want to do. So this is the dashboard. Step number two, what you would do is click on new video. This is going to walk you through on how to create a video within Synthesia.io. And what you do is you essentially can choose if you want to use templates. Say if you're trying to make a video with different scenes like a product demo or maybe you have like a corporate training video you wanna do. All you do is choose a template here and then select it and it will open it. I'll show you an example here. Like this is a corporate training one. So I'll click on use template and that will open the video in which we can start creating this video. And then what you can do is edit everything here. This is essentially kind of like a small little mini video editor in which we can edit all the settings here. I can I can left click, drop and drag anything I want here. I can actually change the avatar. I can search for new ones. See, I'm using Jude right now. But if you scroll down, we can use Amanda. We can use Arthur. Um, there's a ton of them to choose from. Like watch this. I'll choose Arthur and it will change it. Um, so I'm going to hit the delete button just because we already have one in here and it's Jude and it's probably going to work okay. But yeah, I can add, I can edit the background. If I click here, I can click on the media tab and then add a different background into here. These, these icons up here are essentially how you can edit the different aspects of this video. And then down below here, this is where we're going to put your script. Come up with a script, maybe in ChatGPT or you have one by yourself, and then just paste the article here. And that's what your AI avatar is going to to present and he's going to say in the video. Then to click um, to have more scenes, just click add scene here and then we can choose different types of styles of scenes here. Um, there's different layouts here of this specific style of template for the video. And then just go in there, add a scene. I'll click this one here and it essentially adds it. Then we'll go into here and edit everything here. And then we'll just go step by step in the video here and have different multiple scenes until you have a finished video. Maybe you have a 30 minute video of your avatar talking and guys, this is crucial. Like this is going to save so much time for like businesses trying to create videos, especially like talking head videos, corporate videos, training videos, product demo videos. This is going to be crazy. Like even as a content creator, I am like low key a little scared of the power here of like what can be done. So then once you're done, um, you know, there, we can essentially, I mean, you might have questions on what we can edit and the question is everything. Like just click on the element and then you can edit it over here on the right or up top here. And there's different, there's so many settings I could sit here and go over that it's gonna blow your mind. You could add your logo here. And then once you're done with your video, what you can then do is click up here on the play button. And then that's going to be step number three is essentially just watch your video. And then once you're done there, you can generate the video. And depending on what pricing plan you have is going to depict how many uh, videos you can create. So if we look at Synthesia's pricing plan, and again, it's it starts at like 18 bucks a month, I want to say. The starter plan is around 18 to $20 a month. I'm in that right now. One setback, though, is that you only get 120 minutes of video a year. And that's at that plan, which kind of sucks. That is a downfall. But if you get the creator plan, you'll get 360 minutes of video a year. I just wanted to touch base on that. And if at any point during the video you want to check out Synthesia.ai, just hit up my affiliate link down below and you'll get a free trial to just try it out to use. And again, this is crazy. This technology, this is just one aspect of this tool. Next, uh, step number four what I want to show you is essentially just creating an AI avatar video from scratch. So if you just click on new video and then you just click down here where it says start from blank, this is essentially you starting a video from scratch. And so we can not only use AI avatars, the ones that Synthesia.io, the ones they offer us, like all, here's the list of them. There's a bunch of them. And we can not only do that, but we can actually train Synthesia 
to have our own avatars. Like I'll go over that in a little bit. So to start this video from scratch here, you just choose your avatar, right? And then from there, you'd put your script down here for the scene, say if this was a, like scene one, then you could add a background text, logos, like let's just add a background just to show you how cool this is. Again, I'm not gonna add that one because it's a picture, but actually, yeah, let's do that. It's a video with a video avatar on it, so this could be really cool. So then move the avatar to the front here, and then bring this picture to the background. And then put your script on here, and then click play, and you can watch it happen. And just know that sometimes her mouth, or the avatar's mouth, doesn't move unless you generate the video. And it does, you don't use any of your points or your minutes of video generation until you click generate. So then once you're done with that, just click add a scene, and then you can do a blank scene, you can just do, you can add tons of different layouts here, which is cool. This one has like motion graphics coming in it. Uh, there's so many scenes that it's gonna blow your mind. So you can do that as well. And then um, all you do is click generate and you have your video. That's if you wanna custom build an AI avatar from blank, like a video from blank. Then we also have this feature. And again, I'm just kinda of gonna move past this as quick as possible. Actually, for fun, I wanna quickly show you some of the videos that I've made that are probably gonna blow your mind. Cause you might, be, you might be wondering, well, what are some examples I could see, right? Cause maybe you're watching this tutorial in advance to see like the, like the quality level of this. So I made this guy a little bit ago and it's a video on how to create or tips on how to grow on social media, right? And I picked this avatar, there's no background, super basic, and I generated this video. So let's have a listen and let me know in the comments. Uh, let me know in the comments. Do you think you can tell the difference that this is AI versus not being AI? Because that's going to be the big question, right guys? All right, let's click play. If you want to grow on social media, there are a few key things you absolutely have to get right. First, consistency is everything. Pick a posting shit. So, can you tell the difference here? Like, isn't that insane? Like, this has this has my mind rolling on, like, what type of things I could be doing. Because, like, if this, uh, you know, Synthesia allows us to not have to actually shoot videos. Like, if I clone my face doing these videos, I don't, I'll save the time on shooting. And also, a lot of people don't think about this, but I'll save the time on video editing. Like, having to pay a video editor, it's done because, like, I don't have, the, I'm not making mistakes in the video. I'm not removing ums and ahs. This AI avatar, uh, they're not gonna do that. So like, it's a it's a huge game changer. And then another feature that is really cool is you can actually, this is called the AI video assistant. So this is step number five. What we'll do is use the AI video assistant. This turns articles or it's a, it, it essentially, you upload a format of video or a format of content, right? We're talking PDFs. We're talking, um, what does it say? PDFs, Word documents, text documents, PowerPoints. You can even paste a URL of an article online or a prompt. You can tell it a prompt. You can just upload your script and it will just build a video for you. I'm gonna take a deep breath for this. It will build a video for you based on an article. So like, say if I was shooting a video on how, how to do forklift training for my business and I found an article on how to do it, I'll just paste the article in there and Synthesia AI will create the entire video for me and it will put the AI avatar in there. It's, it's nuts, guys. Like, if you're not excited about this, like, it's low-key nuts. And, like, as a content creator, like, I, that's a hard swallow for me over here. Hard swallow. And you can just choose your templates. So, like, we tested this and it's insane. It works so good. And all you do is paste your article in there and it just walks you through the outline and then you can just essentially make the video and just choose how long you want the video. It'll do up to five minutes, which is crazy, crazy, crazy. And then also we have the selfie avatar video section. So this is where you train it to essentially, um, what, what we're doing here is we're creating an AI, an AI avatar out of our own body essentially, so that you don't have to go and shoot videos anymore. And what we do here, I'm gonna show you. Um, all we do here is connect the webcam, and then click continue, and then you read a script, right? Um, I'm using my webcam right now, so it's not going to allow me to do it, but you essentially, you read this script, you take off your glasses, because what it wants to do is it wants to read your eyes, right? And your facial expressions, it's gonna read everything. And then it's gonna give you a script to learn how you talk. And then it's going to essentially create an avatar. You give it consent, and it's gonna create an avatar, and it's gonna blow the pants off of you, like how good it is. And it's 
it's low key a little bit scary. And these are essentially the main features of this tool. Also, what you can do is you can dub videos. I need to put my glasses back on because I am blind without them. Um, so I, I did a, a dubbing video right here. And what I did was I uploaded like a 29 second video uh, where I speak English. And I told it to dub the video in Bangladesh, I think, or Chinese or something like that. So let's have a listen to this video. Just take a second, just to show you the results of it. Okay, so that's also another feature this tool does, but I don't know if people are going to be using this feature. And hit me up in the comments. Like, I think a lot of, like, I think YouTube and some of the algorithms already do this. So, like, I don't know. I don't know, though. I've also heard that some people are capitalizing on getting a lot of views by going and taking all of their content and putting it and uploading it in a different language for different countries. Like obviously you do, if you, if I went and took all my videos and dubbed them in Spanish and then did a Spanish channel, I might get a ton of viewership that way. That being said though, I think YouTube now has this built into it, like for a lot of videos. I, and I think, uh, hit me up in the comments. I need to, I need some feedback on that. I'm pretty sure they do have that though. So essentially you can just make uh, avatar videos using the avatars they have or what you can do is essentially um, create your own avatar to make your own videos. So like there's a lot to be done here. And I get a lot of questions on the comparisons, you know, like because a lot of times people are wondering, because chances are you're down the wormhole of researching like these best AI avatar like tools. So one of the biggest, the two biggest ones are HeyGen and Synthesia. And I've tested both of these and I get questions all the time on these. And here's the breakdown of it. Synthesia has the best quality avatar videos. And but the pricing is a little steeper than HeyGen. So if you sign up with HeyGen, what will happen is you get you actually get with some other plans unlimited amounts of videos on their monthly plan. Whereas Synthesia is a higher quality video and it's a little more expensive. So you're kind of going to choose quantity or quality. And I I, I tend to lean on quality just because I feel like you're messing around with AI, you're creating these avatars. I feel like Synthesia is my go-to personally, and it kind of depends how much footage you need. Like if you're looking to just bulk produce a thousand YouTube videos, then probably HeyGen is going to be a better deal. And again, I'll throw links to both of these down below. The pricing is a little comparable. Uh, Synthesia is, is lower in pricing to start. But hey, Jen, if you're using a lot of it, it's going to be cheaper. So I'm just going to say that. And again, guys, this is an amazing tool. And this is a full tutorial on how to use Synthesia.ai. And this is a step-by-step -step guide. Hit me up in the comments. Let me know what are you looking to use these AI avatar videos for? Like, do you have ideas rolling like I do? I thought about just building an entire channel on like just boring educational content where someone's just sitting there rambling I wanted to pay a video editor. The The content will be cheap. I don't know. Hit me up in the comments. Um, consider subscribing. I'm just a normal person. And I do actually dork up with this stuff. So I do try to help. That's why I do these videos. And yeah, let me know. All right, guys. Have yourself a great day. Later.